There are eight Sundays every fall and winter when 80,000 Bills fans take over Orchard Park. Now, for the families who live down by the stadium, that can become a bit of a mess when fans get a little rowdy doing their tailgating. So now the town is taking action, not allowing new private parking lots. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Sierra Johnson spoke with neighbors about this decision. She joins us now with more. Sierra. Thank you. Today I sat down with Orchard Park Town Supervisor Patrick Keem. He tells me this one year moratorium is a direct result of complaints the town board received from neighbors concerned about an increasing number of tailgate lots and satellite parking in and near residential neighborhoods. Under the new moratorium, no new commercial permits will be granted in the town of Orchard Park for commercial lots or the expansion of lots within one mile of the stadium. This is in place for the next year. Orchard Park Police will keep a close eye on any changes. Anyone caught by Violating the moratorium could face a $100 to $500 fine each day. But a neighbor I spoke to who's lived on Big Tree Road since the stadium opened says this move is too little, too late. The thing, this is postponing the inevitable. I think it should have been no knocking down the houses, no making parking lots. Finish. What are you going to do in a year's time? You're going to do another year, another year. I did ask Supervisor Keene what the town planned to do when that moratorium expired. He says a team is in place right now to investigate the pros and the cons of halting lots. And by the end of the year, they hope to decide to move whether or not this move is permanent. Again, this moratorium of impacts lots that would be created within one mile of the center of that stadium. What are your thoughts? Share them with us on Facebook. Sierra Johnson, 7 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Sierra.